The current state of marketing, I think, is really complex right now because there's been a real shift in who has control over the marketing dialogue right now, and it's really the consumer. We're no longer necessarily just hunting for the cheapest deal, but we're rather shopping where we can get the most uh, convenient and engaging experience. What consumers are expecting has changed a lot. Before, it was just about having a great product when they buy it. It's about having a good service off the back of it. Now, they want to be working with brands or seeing brands grow that have got the same values that they have and believe in the same things that they do. Customer experience is the new frontier for competitive differentiation. The shift to what they expect is, has increased dramatically. The new marketing landscape is, is not for the short term and it's not for the week, right? And you know, not only do we have to earn the right to have those conversations, we need to know a lot more about our consumers today, which is why you hear so much about data. Those things are really important for us to not only earn that conversation with the customer, but make sure that we're actually having the conversation the customer wants to have. The ability to orchestrate the communications in a delivered in a personal manner at the right time with the right message across that sort of whole experience is really something that companies are trying hard to do. And it's not easy. The consequence of getting those key moments of marketing wrong is just a complete lack of forgiveness. But there's no doubt if you get it right, you're in a much better position to create more loyal relationships with your end customer. What it's really about now is how do we keep an ongoing dialogue with the customer? And the ongoing dialogue does a lot of things. It allows us to be a better partner with our customer. It also allows us to get a lot more information from the customer to make our products and services better. One of the biggest challenges for marketers at the moment is the need to demonstrate the performance of marketing that, that they're conducting. So I think that's why digital and that's why performance really increased over the last sort of five to 10 years, because it's something that, that marketers can measure. And when you can measure something and you can see the success, it means that you can do more of it and you can demonstrate that back to the business. If you really want to excel in the experience economy, then you need to do a lot more than marketing to succeed. And so those who will succeed are the individuals or the companies who are able to integrate data with innovative thinking and all the other marketing disciplines that we know to form a complete and holistic experience for their target audiences. I think the future of marketing is around experience management. It's moving away from traditional one-shot campaigns into something that's building a relationship over time, whether you know them as a consumer or whether you know them as a customer.